boy. Hello everyone, Happy New Year. Apparently it's 2015 now or some shizzle. I don't think it's that much different though. Well, I'll go back in time and then it'll be identical to what it was. So, I need now to go to Labrinia. Because the game told me to! <laughs> and I have to do what the game tells me to do! <laughs> Wait a second. I think I misunderstood the hint, well not the hint, the deliberate instructions given by my wife. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, anyway, in the present she says, um, it must be somewhere in Liburnia. I, so that's the name of the country that I'm in? I'm sure that little detail in the text of the very first part of this game, I was totally expected to absorb, because everything that's in words, I'm expected to care about, because that's how video games work, yes, yes. So, um, if the tower's complete, just gonna go to the fucking tower. Let's just do that. Present day Lena. Let's go to the tower's entrance is actually to the north. I remembered that. Oh, fuck me. Forgot, have to do the thing where I rapidly tap the D-pad. I, I, I can't think that there's anybody who would argue with me that this is an egregious lack of control convenience. Maybe some people are willing to put up with it, but nobody could straight-facedly tell me that it's a good thing. Anyway, let's see if I can get into this place now. You know, for being a finished tower, you still can't actually do jack in here. Let's, let's try warping back into the past like a good person is known to do. I don't know who particularly, but there must be somebody. Jason went to hell, but he didn't do it for you. Oh my. What's this? Whoa! Um, let's warp out elsewhere. <laughs> because I think something really weird is happening in the past tower. I do not recall this. this. Yeah. Like I've said many times before, I don't respect your time. This, this is right where I tried to warp. There, there's nothing here. Is there nothing new going on? That'd be really depressing if that were the case. Huh? <laughs> if memory serves, it was weeks ago, but if... Wasn't that the same thing he said back then? I certainly don't remember their snakes being in here. Oh god, it just seems all too likely that I'm misremembering this and I'm gonna have to go look back at the very first video again and go like, oh, I should have micro-memorized the whole game. Especially the parts that I didn't care about. Oh, but I, I certainly don't remember slashing enemies. I don't think I even had a sword at that point, did I? This, this was months ago, sadly, because I'm only able to record a video, like, on the weekends, so I... Yeah, I really don't recall this. Maybe this is the right place to be, if there's things to kill. And maybe it's also where the game wants me to go, too, in addition to it being the right place to be. Yeah, I certainly didn't see these dudes before. I certainly didn't see these dudes before. Okay, yeah. Why, did, why didn't it let me just warp to the entrance of the tower then before? I, it was completely innocuous. There was nothing important going on there. This might be the most contiguous fighting I've done in this game so far. It feels good. It feels sexy good. This is weird, but alright. I wonder if, I'll, if that's just set dressing or if I'm expected to do anything with that later. Just seems like a combat rush for the time being. And no problem with that -o. I love the killing of things. I've said this many times. Killing things is my favorite thing after killing things. That's right. I like it so much that it's actually both my first and second favorite thing to do. That actually occupies something like the top ten slots of my favorite activities. Because there's different ways in which you can kill things. You can do it quickly. You can do it slowly. You can do it flavorfully. You can do it blandly. Just, you know, just go ahead and attach a bunch of adjectives or adverbs to that and you'll get you'll get the point. Because I, while I'm, while I'm having the fun of killing things, I don't want to come up with a bunch of adjectives or adverbs. You know, producing words during an LP? What the hell do you people want? It's so unreasonable. I'm jumping with happiness. It's so good to be able to kill things. I don't care if I'm coming at this with level 1 equipment. 
with how easy Zelda games usually are, that might just make an interesting challenge. Yes! Having to hit an enemy multiple times! Oh god! My dick is so stiff that it's holding up my computer desk a couple of inches. It's actually causing a da dangerous ergonomic situation with my wrists. Hmm. So we have a game show. Door number one, door number two, door number three. Let's see... What is a good scientific solution that is certain to lend optimal results? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a maku tree by the toe. And no, I'm not trying to say that black people are all trees. That was very racist of me, I apologize. Ah, so I'm going to end up going through all those doors eventually, no doubt. And that was not the right one, because it seems to have just sent me right back to where I was. And I am not given a map. And this also sent me right back where I was. <laughs> okay, something's going on. Might be making me look tremendously dirt-tarded, but I have faith in the process. Yeah, I'm sir totes feeling like I just came back to where I was, and those doors have a trick or some kind of clever hidey whitey mechanism that is not readily obvious. Let's just go downstairs. I'm not finding any enemies, so almost certainly have come through here. How about that? Let me get back to those doors. I'm going to be really irritated if it turns out there was some text-based hint, you know, hours of gameplay ago that would have told me how to deal with this. Let's try something. Just for the sake of cementing my reputation of stupidity in the annals of history. Nope, the tune echoes in vain. I am indoors, after all, and music doesn't work well indoors. Let's try going back through the same door over and 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 over again. Boy, this is super productive. I can just I can just feel stuff happening in my gut bones. That's right, I have bones in my gut. They're called your gut bones. It is part of human anatomy. You're not allowed to question. You have to just take it on faith, even though I have no evidence. Well. Fuck sticks and pickup tricks. I... <laughs> I don't want a text-based hint. Alright, let me do some stuff or something. I don't know. Couldn't figure it out. I'm leaving. I think I'm gonna go find Nehru, ask her... whatever. Um, although I'll admit to being mildly upset if it ends up... if it turns out that I had to walk all the way to the top of the tower, figure out that I couldn't proceed past those doors, and then go back and talk to Nehru with some kind of a dialogue switch trigger thingy dingy, but... I shouldn't expect any better from this game by now, seriously. Alright, Nehru, what do you got? Probably nothing, but... <laughs> Wait, Ralph? Now, please don't tell me I need Ralph's help to get past those doors. Oh. So, yeah. I just started exploring around at random, and I remembered, um... I have a Zora scale now, which means I can probably talk to this dude. Except, yes. Zora scale, so you're UD. You may pass. I know I should but but uh, very well. Because I'm the player character, all right. All right, so I have no idea what's here, but I'm in the past. This is the Sea of Storms, according to the map. Let's see how stormy this sea is. All it looks like is it's just artificially sectioned off with designed whirlpools. Boy, this is exciting. But let's let's dive. Cut some seaweed. Do some marine deforestation deforestation. You know? That could, if it's not already, become a euphemism for a woman trimming her hair, if you know what I mean. Oh boy. I, I care about that. I'm smelling a time warp in the very near now. Yeah. Let's just... Whoa, whoa! What's that? <laughs> 
pirate ship? What? How, how did I go from being in the water to being instantaneously in their barracks? No, CO no return. You know, sing me the shanty of the sea. I matey. You go to the ruins out of the east, you can never return. Great! I love never returning. Can I get out of here and never return? Captain is about thinking about thing. I'm sorry, I can't do a like a British pirate accent, but I can do a southern hillbilly hick accent. Uh, been long adrift. Is this your whole ship? I seriously hope that there's more to it than just these quarters. Sail in the seas is every man's dream. It was a grant to shell so gallantly off to my dreams, but we got stuck in the sea of storms and can't get out. Har har har, I get the source but the boo boo. Sure. What the fuck? Um Thank ye, you're a good man. Ahoy, mateys, we're off to O Oh Alodrum. Alodrum. That sounds like a Tolkienian location, like something from the Tolkien legendarium. Um, this is the land of the seas. Uh, aye, aye, sir. I think you know the tip of 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 the tip had a dialogue exchange and then got a key item from it. This is very fulfilling. I, I feel as though my gameplay time is being well spent. Yeah, I guess they're gone. Alright, so I got... A, I got a Toke eyeball? Dude! That's wicked cool. Did it actually come out of a Toke skull? I hope so. Oh man, I'm gonna wear it around my neck. And I'm gonna go to Crescent Island and wear it right in front of their faces. You wanna know where this came from? It wasn't from a gift shop. <laughs> so we just have to decide past Toke or present Toke. I'm already in the past time plane, so let's just go there. I don't know which of the Toke, if any, to talk to, so I'm going to begin by speaking with the one I hate the most. Well, second most after the one who played me that minigame. Just fuck the shield. I already have a better one. Well, okay, let's, let's... I dare you. I fucking dare you. Just tell me. No. Go to hell. Go to hell in a basket of fruit and gifts. Alright, well. So, do I just start talking to all of them at random and see who it was? Let's, let's just go to the present. Let's just go to the present and talk to this Toke in the same location and see if he's got anything to say. And then I'm gonna go rubbing my face against this whole goddamn island if I don't have to. Oh, no, yeah, it was just a gasha tree that's there. Every time I say that word, I want to pronounce it geisha, but then I think of, like, Japanese prostitutes hanging off a tree. And that's, that's, that's not a cool mindset. Prostitutes don't grow on trees, you know. There was probably something that captain said that I wasn't, like, reading close enough, was it? And now I can't find that captain again to recover my thing, so... Fuck! Oh, I hate it so much, and I'm sorry, I know I said I would stop, but goddammit. <clears throat> I remember. The totem head. There was a totem head here. This is almost certainly where I have to put the eyeball. Yep. Is this the eighth dungeon? That'd be a really short intro dungeon segment if that's the case. No, okay. Show your courage, wisdom, and power. Ode to the past shall then open. I'm already in the past. Do you not realize that I am a temporal traveler? Huh. For a half second there, I was wondering if there was going to be some special gimmick to killing these dudes, but nope. At least... No, apparently not. So that was my power, I guess? Now this is probably my wisdom. Or is this my courage? Doesn't matter. Just get out of Bangle and start lifting and throwing all day long. Oh, shizbiz. Ah! Ah! God damn it! There, there is a better way to do, handle that than what I just did. I'm just running right past it and clocking up a heart's worth of damage. Right. Let's bomb like a guy named Tom. I'm sure there have been demolition experts named Tom at some, some point in history, right? Ah. So is this testing my wisdom or just my ability to tank damage? Because that's what it sounds like. <laughs> okay. Uh, 
switch hook. Yeah, switch hook. <laughs> we. <laughs> what? 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 That's a W A T what? Let's try this again. Okay, so in, let's let's take a guess here. Invisible floors? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Let's try some seeds. Somebody pointed that out as a uh, potential problem solver. Actually, no. It'll have to be one that doesn't dissolve instantly, like a scent seed. Uh huh. Um, let's actually get a weapon and then use this as the secondary. There we go. Die, Pat! I hate flying small rodent mammals. Is this really how I meant to do this? I don't have enough seeds to go all the way through. This is silly. Okay. No. No, no, no. There's gotta be another way to do this. This is a retard chasm. No! This is dumb! Is there... Is there a hint that I'm missing? Fuck it. Just... Fuck it. Just fuck it. Just walk. Okay. Now I know that's as far as I can go in that direction. I'll die a few times, but who gives a shit eating pit? Um... Fuck shits. This is... This is retarded. Am I... Am I supposed to take these objects that are around here as guides for what to do with this? Is there any way to light this room up that I'm forgetting that I have in my my weapons? Let's try bombs for a bit. Oh, actually, actually no, I can't set a bomb down. Oh, I guess I can. Okay, that falls. This I'm so sorry to make you watch this. Me brute forcing this. This is this is retarded on epic levels. <sighs> this I feel really stupid right now. It seems almost certain that there's something I'm missing. How? What? Fuck me. Attempt number two on the retarded room of lies. But unless there's some obvious gimmick that comes to like, um, comes to light. T. There's a T at the end of that word. I'm not gonna make you watch me do this every single time because this is. I'm seriously feeling like there's some thing I should be seeing that I'm not seeing. No? I, I feel like I'm supposed to use the objects, the visible objects, as hints for where to go and what to do, but it's not being that way. See, I try to walk up to be parallel to this thing again, and it just ends up killing me. Say, so I, I walk until it's on the edge of the screen, and then I can go back this way. So it is there, just this game's hit detection is throwing me over. Does any Was anybody else frustrated as fuck when they first came to this room? Be honest. Because I don't want anybody saying, oh, UD, I micro-memorized this when I was a kid, therefore you should immediately understand it the first time you set foot in here. Because goddamn, on Aunt Jemima's black butt cheeks, this is the least fun thing I have done since waking up this morning. No, yeah, I, that's, that can't be it. Because I try to go parallel with it, and then I go off into the inky void. I go just below parallel with it. <sighs> this is arbitrary. I mean, it thinks it's not arbitrary, but really it's arbitrary. So, yeah. Well, what am I supposed to do after walking up to it again? Brute force by dropping unlimited seeds and bombs right in front of my face? Fuck that. Okay, so... Here, I'm gonna do just this one. See, it drops off there. It drops off there. Drops off there. The only place it doesn't drop off is where I just came from. Does it drop off here? Does it drop off here? Well, I'm out of seed, so I don't goddamn know anymore. What the shit, Buckets? It's like the path just stops right here. Or does it? I... 
I don't get it. Okay, go until it's just barely at the edge of the screen. Go up right below it. Walk back over. Oh. No. No, 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 no. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. Fuck that. That means that there's one tile right here where I'm standing right now. This one tile just leads off just this is a this is a cul-de-sac that I'm standing on right now and I'm expected to go up again here or not what the fuck shits god damn it one more time and then I'm doing this shit off camera cuz this is fucking retarded okay so we found that right here was the cul-de-sac where I'm standing so I should but I I think I THINK I got a seed impact right there. So, no! It falls off into the void. Fuck this. I think I found the way forward. Don't know why that worked. Don't really care to figure out the answer. Whoever thought that that was going to be fun or engaging or intellectually stimulating needs to go fucking... I'm sorry, I said I wouldn't do that anymore. Um, I would like to take the Capcom logo and take the C and break it over my knees so, such that it straightens out with a bone-cracking <coughs> sound, and then I want to kick the P so hard that it turns around and becomes a Q. There we go. No comical violence suggested against Capcom employees, just the logo, which is fitting considering that somebody at Capcom let this out the gate. I'm, I'm, I'm tempted to say that there would ultimately be one person who was just responsible for getting this out the gate. But was there? Was it just a bunch, or was it just a bunch of people who were doing their jobs? What am, I, what am I supposed to do here? I can push these dudes. <laughs> or at least one of them. Um, well, okay. If pushing them into an e equal triangle doesn't work, let's try pushing them all in line. Oh my. Did that do a thing? Well, where am I? Someplace I've never been, so you have no return. Okay. I'm not happy about this, but fuck it. I don't even give a shit anymore. I expect shitty design out of everything in this game but the dungeons. Like, oh, that's supposed to be a ledge. Okay, that just looked like an incomplete wall texture. But no, it's that's trying to say it's higher up. Sea of No Return. Is that how you guys all got here, too? Because you're kind of the same enemies that I've seen on the overworld, except for you devil dudes. Hmm. Probably meant to have stronger equipment than what I have, but to hell with it. A little bit of combat challenge would do me good. Ah, these things. I saw these before in that cave where I didn't know what to do. That looks like an exit. Yay! Yay. Maybe I'll just use a switch hook and just kind of, like, speed run through this. Let's try it. Mobility equipment rather than combat equipment. I mean, I have a large majority of the maximum number of rupees that I can carry. I really doubt there's any loot these guys could give me upon death that I would care about, so... Let's just switch places with them. Like a bad show on a cable channel home improvement garden better... Pets and roller coasters, something like that. Better pets and roller coasters. Sounds like a hit, right? Use a hashtag. Hashtag better pets and roller coasters. Why did I do that? There was no reason for me to do that. Nor was there any reason for me to. Oh, can I not? I can't switch hook with those dudes. With the Chimera. 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 Centerite. Quadrupeds, but still with active arms and hands. Oh, but I can reset which position on the map they're in just by walking off screen and coming back. Well, isn't that just amazing? Let's try it, just to be certain. Yeah, it doesn't work. I'll just jump over them then. Who cares? What's up here? Oh! Ancient tomb. Okay, this looks interesting. This looks really goddamn interesting. I find myself curious to try this. Um, well then. I... Uh, I don't think I have the time right at this moment to do a whole another dungeon in the same video, so I'll probably just cut this off as a short video here and come back to do this eighth dungeon at a later time. It could be as early as tomorrow. 
my schedule is rather clear, and I think that is the thing that I will do. So, um, yeah. I have, I have clever, important, and interesting things to say. That's, that's why I'm over here on this side of the screen, and you're sitting there. Yeah, I'm, I'm the dude on the screen. What, did you think the situation was otherwise? Oh, 